Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of C3 with N3 that is Cheat Codes and Concepts with your mentor Dr. Nikita Nanwani Nathani. So the whole purpose of having the series is to simplify complex topics for all of you. So in our today's uh, session, we would be discussing about the cheat codes to remember the various pregnancy signs, the uterine signs in pregnancy, which are seen in early pregnancy. So this topic I've come up with on the request of many students uh, who find it difficult to remember the various pregnancy signs. So I'll be sharing some easy cheat codes and mnemonics to remember these signs. So the various signs that we would be seeing are the six most frequently asked signs. As you can see, we'll discuss the Palmer sign, Hagar sign, Goodall sign, Osiander sign, Jacquemer or Chadwick sign and Piscas X sign. So before we dive into our session where I'll be sharing some amazing cheat codes to remember this, uh, let me tell you in brief about myself. So I am Dr. Nikita and I've done my MD and DNB in radio diagnosis and MBBS as well from Mumbai. And in my first attempt itself, I've got a all India rank 63 in AIMS and a state rank 10 in 2012. And that is how I landed up doing radiology at TNMC Mumbai. So I am a medical mnemonist in the sense that I love to make mnemonics the cheat codes to simplify complex topics, but I also concentrate on concepts as well. So I have eight years of teaching experience in the field of postgraduate medical entrance examination. So uh, there's a huge announcement for all of you. You have your next free live class on an academy need PG with me on 15th of October. So this is an exceptional session in the sense that it would be an integrated session where myself and Dr. Preeti Sharma, who's pathology faculty at an academy, we would be having an integrated session and we would be discussing high yield radiopath integrated MCQs. So you will have live poll and it's in the form of a quiz. So we'll see who wins that episode. So remember, it's on 15th of October, Thursday, 6 p.m. on the Unacademy app, on the learning app. All you need to do for that is download the Unacademy learning app and then go to the special classes section to watch the free live class. Now, uh, you can also subscribe to Unacademy Plus platform, which is for subscribers. And you can use my referral code, Dr. Nikita, to get the additional discount while subscribing. So what are the advantages of the Plus subscription? So you have live classes at the comfort of your home. You have live tests and quizzes, live polls during the classes. There are structured courses. There is unlimited access. One subscription gives you unlimited access to all the courses of all the educators available on the platform for and something amazing has also come up. So we have iconic subscription now. So with this one iconic subscription, you get the best of live sessions of an academy and the recorded sessions of prep ladder and all the learning resources in one subscription. So yeah, you can also use my referral code Dr. Nikita for the same for iconic subscription. There's a plus course also running where I'm also part of that batch course, which is Operation Need PG 2021. So if you are one of those who has not yet started preparation for Need PG, this is the course which you can join. You can also join the high yield uh, topics course, which is uh, coming up very soon on the platform that will definitely give you an edge in the preparation. And so we have also started with the daily live quizzes, uh, which are free and available to all. So for NEED PG 2021, there is NEED PG T20, which is a daily free live quiz, which is there at 8 p.m. every day uh, on the Unacademy Learning app. And for NEED PG 2022 as well, we have a daily MCQ series of 20 questions at 9 p.m. So remember 8 p.m. and 9 p.m. Apart from that, we as educators also conduct the live quizzes. So you can stay updated and connected with us on the Telegram group, An Academy Need PG. And uh, I personally host quizzes at 9 p.m. and 11 p.m. as well. So yes, let's start with our today's session. As I told you, these are the six important signs that we would be discussing. These have been asked frequently. That's why I'm concentrating on these. So how do we remember the various signs? So the first sign is your Palmer sign. So uh, generally what they give you is in the question, either they'll give you the description and they'll ask you which of these is the signs which describes this or they'll give you Palmer sign is, you know, the uterine contraction or the dusky hue of the vagina. So either ways. So let us see what is Palmer sign. So the regular and rhythmic uterine contraction is the Palmer sign. So easy to remember Palmer, remember the palm of your hand. 
and imagine yourself doing like this the exercises so contracting relaxing contracting relaxing so the palm contracts and relaxes this is how we do the palm exercises so palmar sign is related to the uterine contraction so remember palm is contraction next is your hagar sign okay next is your hagar sign so alphabetically if you see a b c d e f g h after h comes i so you can remember it as hi as well okay so calling yourself hi so h i hagar is basically the softening of the isthmus so you have the uterus body you have the isthmus and you have the cervix so the softening of the isthmus is known as the hagar sign hi this is what you have to remember so because of the softening of the isthmus the upper part this is you know enlarged because of the fetus the cervix is firm so on bimanual examination when we do you we can see that the fingers they are opposed in the region of the isthmus because of the softening so on bimanual examination with two fingers in anterior fornix and fingers of other hand behind the uterus the abdominal and vaginal fingers seem to oppose below the body of the uterus because of this softening of the isthmus so remember isthmus softening is hagar sign then we have the gudel sign so gudel sign is softening of the cervix so if you have attended my previous sessions we have seen many cheat codes where we see that alphabet c and alphabet g they look together they they look similar so they go together so cervix softening is your gudel sign okay cervix c is g so c is g you can also remember as the cervix becomes goody goody to feel that means the cervix becomes soft so gudel sign is the cervix softening then is your oceander sign which is increased pulsation felt through the lateral fornices so when we see or uh, when we palpate through the lateral fornices there are increased pulsations felt so oceander you can remember dur dur you know dhar dhar is felt so dhar dhar is your pulsations okay heart ka dhar dhar similarly it is the pulsations so pulsations are felt through the lateral fornices so that is your oceander sign then is your jacumer sign which is also known as chadwick sign so you can remember it as jackie chan right so jacumer jackie and chadwick is chan so remember jackie chan and you can imagine jackie chan wearing a blue shirt so dusky hue or blue color of the vestibule and anterior vaginal wall due to local vascular congestion so jackie chan blue color remember blue color of the vestibule and the anterior vaginal wall due to congestion then is your priscasex sign which is one half of the uterus is firmer than other half in case of lateral implantation so if there is a lateral implantation one side is soft the other side is firm in case of lateral implantation this is known as priscasex sign so how do we remember this as priscasex sign lateral implantation uterus ek side mein pichak jata hai so priscasex sign pichak jata hai so in case of lateral implantation the one side of the uterus is pichcophyte priscasex and the other side is firm so one side firm of one side soft one side firm that is your priscasex sign yani ki jab uterus ek side mein pichak jayega right so let us quickly you know revise the mnemonics palmar sign palm contracts so your uterine contraction is your palmar sign right your uterine contraction is the palmar sign then we have okay so palm is contraction then we have hagar high that is isthmus softening goody goody service becomes goody goody goodel sign c and g they go together oceander dhar dhar that is increased pulsation through the lateral fornices jackie chan jacumer or chadwick sign blue color that is dusky hue of the vestibule and vaginal wall due to congestion pisca sac pichak jana one side of the uterus due to lateral implantation so one side is firm one side is soft that is pisca sac sign so this is about the mnemonics uh, i hope it helps you remember these most important signs let us quickly solve some of the previously asked mcqs that have been asked on this topic so the question asked was palmar sign refers to so palm contraction so rhythmic contractions of the uterus right and uh, what we see here the pulsations in the lateral fornix pulsations is dhar dhar that is your oceander sign discoloration of vagina blue color jackie chan 
So that is your Jacumer sign or the Chadwick sign, right? Next one, Osiander, Dhar Dhar is pulsation. So pulsation in the lateral fornix, it was asked in one of the Jipmer exams. Blue color, Jackie Chan again. Softening of the cervix, cervix becomes goody goody, that is your goodal sign. On bimanual palpation, finger can be approximated as if nothing is in between. It is due to isthmus softening, high, that is your Hagar sign, right? Next one, palm or sign again, asked in one of the exams, palm contractions. So, uterine contractions is palm or sign. Cervix softening, goody goody, goodal sign, pulsation in fornix, dhar dhar, enter sign. Compressibility of isthmus, Hagar sign. This is your Hagar sign. Next, in early pregnancy, clinical signs of, uh, in early pregnancy, clinical signs, feeling the cervix and the body of bulky uterus separated because of the softened isthmus, Hagar sign, right? H and I. Goodal is cervix softening, Chadwick, Jackie Chan, blue color of the vestibule vagina, Pisca sec, Pichak jana, lateral implantation may it is C. Next one, softening of the uterus with lateral implantation, excite se pichak jana, pisca sec sign, right? Chadwick, blue color, Hagar, high, isthmus, softening, goodal, cervix, cervix becomes goody goody, pisca sec, pichak jana, it is seen in lateral implantation, it is seen in lateral implantation. Next, which of the following is not a sign of early pregnancy? Goodal, yes, cervix softening. Hagar, isthmus. Kalan sign, no. Palmer sign, contraction. Kalan sign, we know C for central discoloration. So, in the periumbilical region, there is discoloration seen in cases of pancreatitis as well. So, Kalan, central discoloration, it is not seen in early pregnancy. Next one, not a sign of early pregnancy. Lemon sign, no. Oceander, yes. Pulsations. Pisca sec, yes. Lateral implantation. Palmer, yes. Contractions. So, lemon sign we know is the shape of the uh, fetal skull where you have the concavity in the frontal region due to the spina bifida or the neural tube defect. So, any neural tube defect can lead to the concavity. Lemon sign. Spina bifida neural tube defect, it is a not a sign of early pregnancy. It is not a sign of early pregnancy, right? So, these were the mnemonics and the various MCQs that have been asked on this topic. I hope uh, I have simplified this topic for you. If you have any other suggestions you want me to cover in the uh, future sessions for the topics, do let us know in the comments. Uh, I shall take up one session with mnemonics on that topic. And yes, uh, remember the next free live class on the Unacademy app, 15th of October at 6 p.m., where myself and Dr. Preeti Sharma would be taking Radio Path Integrated Quiz, which is important for all the NEET PG students, FMG students, INICT students. 